All right, so after a very long and very boring HBO Max press conference or stock meeting, whatever it was, it was really bad. But the one good thing to come out of it was Green Lantern. Green Lantern is getting a TV show on HBO Max. Long rumored that this was going to happen, but it's official, and Greg Berlanti is attached as the showrunner, and the production budget of the show is going to be around $100 million. So we're talking like a Game of Thrones level production budget for this show, which has got me all sorts of excited. They are not holding back anything. We are going to get a Green Lantern show that goes balls to the wall and gives us what we've been wanting from Green Lantern for years. Now, of course, the one thing that's got me like super worried is Greg Berlanti. He's been one of the producers on all those CW shows and the Green Lantern film from 2011. So not exactly the ideal person (laughs) to be doing this show, right? But then again, you know, he had a lot of other producers and writers around him. It's not like he was solely responsible for every CW show or every, you know, Green Lantern movie, whatever. But he was involved. So, you know, that gives me a little hesitation. I would be fine if they just got complete nobody to be the showrunner and put the show together. Uh, But they're going with Greg Berlanti. So let's just hope for the best. Uh, He had a few comments about the show. Uh, He said it's going to be a space action adventure, and that's about all he could say. There's no details from the show yet. We don't know if Jon Stewart's going to be the lead. We don't know if Hal Jordan's going to be the lead. Uh, I hope it's like, you know, they're both like co-starring, and it's like a buddy cop adventure. That would be cool. But what I'm really hoping is that they draw from the best uh, comic book run of Green Lantern there's ever been, and that's the Jeff Johns comic book run of Green Lantern. I really hope they draw from that. Because without a doubt, those are the best Green Lantern stories ever made. Uh, Without those Green Lantern stories, Green Lantern wouldn't be a thing right now. He wouldn't be getting a TV show. They wouldn't have made that movie. The Jeff Johns run is the reason Green Lantern is any relevant right now. So I hope they cherry pick the best parts and we get a Sinestro Core War, you know, on the TV screen on HBO Max with this $100 million budget. I hope we get something like that. That'd be incredible. And I also hope it lasts longer than one season. I hope they give it like a five seasons, you know, give it a fair shake, a fair shot. I don't care if, you know, people aren't watching it. I just want to see a full story arc from the show. Because as we all know, the Green Lantern animated series only lasted one season and they had to rush the end of it. So we never fully got a complete story arc for that show. They really had to rush the second half of that show. And the Green Lantern movie left off on a huge cliffhanger, and we never got to finish that storyline. So I just want them to give the show a fair shake. I want to see a full story arc happen. And I hope they do go down the parallax route with Hal Jordan. I hope he does become parallax at some point. I hope they do go down that road, and Hal Jordan becomes the villain at some point. Like, have him start out the show as the good guy, and by, like, the fourth or fifth season, we see him turn to the bad guy. And I think that'd be incredible. It's a dream I've always had. Even though that storyline with Hal Jordan becoming Parallax took place before the Jeff Johns run, it's still what the entire Jeff Johns run is based off of, right? So just awesome news. We're getting a Green Lantern show. It's going to have a big budget. We don't know what it's about yet, but I'm going to be excited as hell to watch it. I'm definitely going to do a reaction to that trailer when that comes out, and I'll probably be crying like that Star Wars fanboy. (laughs) And I really hope this show takes off, but... uh. Yeah, that's it for now. Comment below. Let me know your thoughts about the Green Lantern show on HBO Max. Uh, What do you hope to see from it? Do you think Greg Berlanti's going to fuck this up? He might. There's like a 50-50 chance here. Uh, But you know, he might do great. We don't know. We'll have to see when the show comes out. But yeah, we still got to wait a while. But anyway, that's it for now. I'll see you on the next one. Bye. Okay. Can we form a construct and replace the defective part for the ride home? The construct would have to be an exact copy of the ultra-warp coil mechanism and its 56 moving parts to within a 0.8162 micron tolerance. Can either of you do that? I make hammers.